What up, what up, y'all? I know it's been a long time, but we're back in the kitchen. I know it was supposed to supposed to find out a long time ago about the rainbow trout versus the lightning trout, if they taste the same. Well, finally, it's that time. All right, so I got it. right now we got our rainbow trout and our lightning trout. The goal is to compare them both and see which one tastes better. I heard people say that lightning trout tastes sweeter Honestly, I don't think that's true. I don't really know. And and I'm not the biggest trout fan, so I needed somebody to uh, test them with me. So my little big sis here is gonna help me out. You you down for trying? I'm down for trying. I, I am. Okay, so all I need is one. I got one. So I'm just gonna, basically we're just gonna grill it. I'm not gonna do all the extra stuff, you know, with the sesame oil and uh, what do you call it? Uh, yeah, I'm not gonna jazz it up all the way. I'm just gonna cook it just so we can taste it. Taste it and see if one actually tastes better than another. I honestly don't think it's gonna be a difference, but we're gonna find out. We're gonna see. Okay. You, the few differences that I've noticed between a lightning trout and a rainbow trout, the lightning trout, they are a lot stronger. Like when you're catching them, the lightning trout fight a lot harder. And I mean, you're just looking at them, they're, they're a lot prettier, you know what I mean? But they're both beautiful fish. Just, but one thing that I did find odd is a lightning trout, it, it don't seem to have scales. I'm tempted to put some sesame oil on it, but let's just do the pepper. On that side, I might put a little sesame oil on it. Do the same thing to both. Some garlic powder. Salt. Got that side done. I'm just gonna take a green onion and just put it inside. All right, all right. So I've decided to go ahead and put a little olive oil and sesame oil on the fish. I wasn't gonna do it, but I changed my mind. As y'all know, I just be kind of, you know, cooking in the spirit. It always just depends on how I'm feeling in that split second. So I'm gonna go ahead and put a little sesame oil. Just a little bit. A little sesame oil on the outside. Just a little bit of olive oil. Let's go on the skin side. I'm, I'm hoping that this will help it not to stick to the grill. Put a good amount of olive oil, just kind of massage that in a little bit. Put these um, fish in the basket, close it up, and hopefully it works good. Never used it before, but I got it, so I'm gonna use it. All right, all right, y'all, here's the triz out. That's how it turned out. As potatoes. Check it out, y'all. Let's see which one of these tastes better. Let's see which one of these tastes better. We're gonna go ahead and pop them off like so. Hmm, that works pretty nicely. You wanna you wanna be the first one, Jimmy? Let me make your plate one, one time. Okay. So let's see. If you don't like it, you're not obligated to eat it. We just try it. We can plate you up some potatoes, some some chip potatoes. These were chips. Sour cream and onion. Get your little dollop. They're a little lumpy. I was a little rushed. I didn't. I feel like if I would have crushed these up first, and then um, maybe like whip them, like like you would do some real mashed potatoes. It would have been better. 
make them pretty. Put a little bit of green onion on top. Ooh, look at that party right there. Look at that. That party right there. Getting fancy with the potato chips. All right, so we're just forking off a piece, right? Yeah. All right, let's try um, the rainbow trout first. I think that's a sufficient am amount. I need some more. I like how flaky it is. It is good, huh? It's cooked real nice. All right, we're going to try this one first because we know it's rainbow trout. That's real gamey and real fishy. Real fishy. Okay. Mm -hmm. I like the brine, but let's see what the... Let's see what the lightning trout the lightning does. Trout I've already cleared off my palate. This one's a lot more soft. That meat was more tough. Yeah. So. I, I, I noticed that from the beginning. Even like when, I, when you catch it and you pick it up out of the water, the, the lightning trout is like, it's soft because it's tough. Paris, you gotta come try. Yeah, it was a very, very fishy. Let's try it out. Um, let's go with the lightning trout first. The lightning trout is softer. That's that's automatic. I kind of figured that from when I was catching them. It's my first time grilling trout. It's not as fishy as you said it was. Maybe you just. That's not fishy. It's not delicious, but it's not fishy. Okay, let's see. Well, she, both of them, let's see. I was gonna say they taste different. What? I did want to try it, I think. No. Hmm. It doesn't have much flavor at all. It, it tastes like fish. I don't think it's fishy. But I don't think they. Let's see. I don't think they taste different. You gonna taste the pears? <laughs> tastes like it needs some salt, but that's about it. I would try not to, to put too much seasoning on it just to get a real taste of it. The lightning trout and the rainbow trout taste the same, but have different textures. The lightning trout seem to be softer and more juicy. Um, yeah, I don't think nothing else is, there's no special. Nothing special about the lightning trout other than the way they look. They're very pretty. Yeah. But, they're softer, more tender. You know. I think if you fried them up as fillets, they're probably yeah. Not tough. Yeah. Okay. What the the other one? Yeah. Cause the rainbow trout is way more tough. Yeah. That one, I fried up nuggets. I would. Yeah. I, I like I said. I, I think it's it depends on your taste. See, look, look how this is the rain the rainbow trout. It holds together better, and it flakes off. Lightning trout. Yeah, see, look how, <laughs> look how more juicy the lightning trout is. See, dang the light. Man, the lighting in the house sucks. But anyway, you could take my word for it. Or go get you some lightning trout and try it yourself. 
lightning trout just seem to be a little bit more juicy. With that said, y'all, thanks for watching. Please like, share, subscribe, and leave a comment down below. I'm gonna catch y'all later, since they so rude. No, I'm not.